Although redheads may only make up 2% of the population, recent studies may show that redheads might be even more unique than you thought. Recent studies suggest that redheads have different genes from the rest of the world. Redhead children and even adults are quite often singled out, and this petty bullying can continue on well into adulthood. This is all part of a prejudice that has existed for centuries against redheads. They have often found themselves being accused of something strange or perhaps even sinister. This is simply because of the colour of their hair. Even in some cultures today where magic and voodoo are believed in, redheads are thought to be evil or witches. Latin writings from the 1300s believe that redheads had the ability to perform magic. For example, it was thought that a redhead could turn copper into gold. After scientific studies, it's now said that redheads are different from the rest of the world's population in some ways. When we think of redhead people, some of us will associate them with certain regions. For example, places that are cold like Scotland. It can be said that the ancestors of redheads most likely lived in cold regions which do not get a great deal of sun. This trait means that people who have red hair also have pale skin, and their protection against the sun isn't great. This is why people with this colour hair are more vulnerable than others. There is another advantage to this genetic heritage. Red haired people are unique in that they can create their own vitamin D. They are able to do this without exposure to the sun. This means they are at less of a risk of getting diseases associated with a lack of vitamins. Scientists have also said the MC1R gene, which provides instructions for making a protein called the melancortin 1 receptor, detects changes in temperature and is much more keenly attuned in redheads than the majority of the population. This means that natural redheads feel the cold and heat much more than others. Another interesting discovery is that a number of investigations have found that redheads are more robust than the general population. So not only can redheads cope with more pain, but they also need around 20% more anaesthetic to knock them out. Since the 19th century, it's been commented upon that redheads give off a pleasing smell. As it happens, the skin of redhead people tends to be more acidic than the average, which means fragrance being broken down in such a way to produce a stronger smell. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.